But you know, we've been going out and introducing ourselves person to person. I'm going to tell you a story about being in Morris, Minnesota last week. Thursday, we're out talking to a group of about 60 people in the middle of the day on a Thursday afternoon, beautiful day, in a pavilion. And we're giving a, a speech about the future of our state and where we think it needs to go. And we're trying to encourage people to get on board and grab their part of the rope and start pulling. Well, we got probably about 10 college kids from Minnesota Morris lined up along the side. And the young people are protesting. And they honestly don't know what they're protesting, but they're protesting. And they've got signs that say, don't cut my wages. And there's a couple of kids at the end that have a sign for Mark Dayton. Well, those of you that have come to know me over the past few years, and you know Jackie, that doesn't bother us a bit. Because we are supposed to, in this country, be able to disagree on things. And we're supposed to understand that at the end of the day, no matter what the disagreement is, we all live here. And we've got to learn how to get along together. So as soon as we were done talking to the group in the pavilion, Jackie and I walked right over to those young kids, introduced ourselves to them one at a time. Hi, my name's Tom. This is Jackie. Where are you from? It's kind of hard to hate one another if you're willing to talk to each other. But as we go on to the end of the line, I've got the two young men holding the Dayton sign. And I said, uh, after introducing myself and finding out the two of them come from the cities and they're in a political science class, surprise, surprise, out of, <laughs> out of Minnesota Morris, I said, uh, great to meet you too. And Jackie was standing off to my side and I said, uh, so you support Mark Dayton? And very proudly, the one in front of me says, yes, we do. And I said, well, that's fine. Why do you support Mark? And very quickly, he says, because Mark Dayton is going to bring jobs back to the state of Minnesota. <laughs> at, at which point, I, uh, you got to be respectful. I said, really? How is Mark going to do that? And the poor young man froze in front of Jackie and me, turned to his friend and said, it's Emmer. Help me out here. <laughs> His friend was just as quick. He turned immediately back and said, he asked you first. You've got to answer. <laughs>